Welcome to careforcustomers.com, the call center management series. Today's session is on cheat sheets. You know cheat sheets, those are those fancy pieces of paper that agents have at their desktop, highlighted areas, underlined sections, bolded areas. They kind of look something like this. Well, cheat sheets can be a concern within the call center. And let's talk about a few of those concerns. First and foremost, they don't get updated regularly. Agents spend a lot of time putting them together and if you pull out one or two and you take a look at it, you're going to find that some information is outdated, some is just blatantly wrong, and processes have moved on, have changed within your call center. So without updated information, when you have agents talking to customers, you're going to get customers who are being provided wrong information. And what happens with customers with wrong information, they find that out eventually, and what do they do? They call you back. So callbacks within a call center, the, that's just not cool. You don't want to have that. And something else that people don't think about, it actually erodes trust in all the effort that you've put into your training and your IT systems. So think about this scenario. New agent freshly freshly out of training goes sits down and they end up sitting beside, you know, let's say Sally. Sally's got a uh, a cheat sheet in her hand and then agent sees her using that on a, on a regular basis and the agent says well geez why don't I just use Sally's cheat sheet why use all this information that they provided me in training and so it erodes that trust and that's not good either within a call center you got to have consistent information uh, being provided by your agents on an ongoing basis so what do you do about cheat sheets first and foremost go out and do this toss them all in the garbage but as soon as you do that Go back and thank the agents who had them because what they're telling you is they're saying, hey, Mr. Call Center Manager or hey, Mr. Call Center Manager, the information I need is not easy to find. And so I had to create that little sheet. So what you need to do is go back and fix the information systems to make sure that the information your agents are requiring, first and foremost, when they're talking with their customers, is easy to find. If you can, go paperless force everyone to use the system don't allow paper at the desktop whatsoever now you find this this as a kind of an ongoing trend and kind of a new trend within the call center industry sp specifically where call centers are using credit card information and you have to be PCI compliant then going paperless helps in that process and it kind of fixes this problem and if you can't do that, or you can't change your information systems, think about creating your own approved cheat sheet. Take all the best that is that you find in these different cheat sheets and print one up on a regular basis. Put it weekly or daily if you can, and you know, give it the approved cheat sheet and hand that out to your agents. That might be just a, a simple, easy way to get all of the information into your agent's hands. It's consistent. It's up to date and first and foremost you know what you know what it says so that's our session on cheat sheets today hopefully some of this has helped you